The Curse of Plum Mountain. One year ago today, my husband died of fright. Nobody knows why. Police ruled it an accident. <laughs> he was really scared of running. It said that after he died, war was beginning. Make your time. I should wait one year and then visit him at the cemetery. Fascinating. What a brilliant story. The Curse of Plum Mountain. All right, well, let's play a new game here. Oh, this is scary. Use arrow keys or WASD keys to move. You can steer by holding the right mouse button too, okay? So uh, basically, I should have left work early. Now it's pitch dark, Sai. Why am I doing here, Christopher? Uh, that, that was the story of the game. I couldn't even introduce it because it just started off right away. But it's a game where a woman's husband died and whatever. It's a scary... It's a scary game! I'm scared right now. Click on things to interact with them. Plum Mountain Cemetery. Back entrance ahead. Um, I mean, this isn't the best way to uh, go dress to, like a cemetery in the middle of the woods you know I'd, I'd take some hiking gear maybe I don't know sneakers definitely not a definitely not a skirt from work this is a good you know dress to go on an interview uh oh uh oh that's not good oh no are you my husband excuse me do you locals know where my husband is okay I gotta get out of here these guys are not being nice ah Okay, so I'm being chased. Okay, I get it. You guys are evil. Can I... Here we go. Where are we going? Wait a second. They're leaving. Oh, good. Well, that's a... That's a... <laughs> how very convenient of them to just leave me alone. Like... <laughs> oh, no. She's running away. Our only weakness. So, uh, has no one ever been to this cemetery before? Like, when, when the other people come to the cemetery and demons spawn, jump out of the ground, nobody thinks to call the police? Alright, so, what is going on here? Where do we... Uh, well, maybe I should read one of these books. And they were no longer little girls, they were little women. Inappropriate book stand, I don't think this came from the library. Read more from the tome. Who's ever defied the laws of nature? Here the statues are moving. Um, so what, what was that about? Alright, I don't know. Okay. Get closer to view. How do I use the statues? Okay, read more. Alright, so that one goes down. Let's see what happens with this one. Oh, as as I read, the statues go down. All right, let me let me try that again. I guess I should read them in this. I should read them in a specific order, I guess. And it's just trial and error. I mean, how would I know what order I'm supposed to read these in, unless I already did this before? This is just pure trial and error. What? Why can't I get through here? Just climb through there. Uh, oh, an elephant can climb through there. What are you doing? What Are you kidding me, lady? Come on. Really? Just go through. Oh, you dumb bitch. Uh, I shouldn't say that. I'm going to get attacked for being sexist. Uh, she's, uh, she's differently um, um, abled when it comes to thinking. That's, that's the correct thing to say. Politically correct thing to say. Alright. Uh, Alright. Let's try that again. Statue goes down. That's not the only thing that I want to go down in this game. If you know what I... Oh wait, I'm being sexist again. No. I, I take that back. I didn't... What I just said wasn't like a blowjob joke about this woman. And I know she just lost her husband, so... That would be really insensitive. What... What, what I meant was, like, go down, like, uh... Alright, here we... Oh, come on! Every time I open I open the door, a window closes. Alright, let's try it. No! Damn it! God damn it! What's the right order? 
All right. And then if I open this one, the other one goes up. All right. Okay. I think I got it. I think. Please, God. Oh, no. Damn it. What happens? What if I do that? Damn it. It's like I almost need to read one of these books, like, <laughs> while I'm in the middle of that stupid statue. Ugh. Alright, this is pure trial and error. Alright, here we go. We did it. We did it. I think. I hope we did it. I gotta run through. Whoa! Oh my god! Alright. Oh, my phone is ringing. Better pick up that phone, bitch. How do I pick up the phone? Oh, items, cell phone, answer phone. Hello? Hey, babe, you came to my after party. Hey, that's the husband. Didn't he die? That's not funny. Um, okay. All right, I don't care. I can break a... I, can, I can't be a prank call because you have no soul reception. I called to warn you that things aren't going according to plan. Uh, what, what is happening here? Can I... I'm stuck. Okay, strafe. Strafe. Let, let's do a little dance. Can't touch this. Can't touch this. Look, so you're claiming you're Christopher and you're alive. Hey, Christopher, if you really are Christopher, what was the song that played during our first date? That's right. Hammer time. There's supposed to be a pious grave near here. I mean, it wouldn't hurt to look at it, right? Come on, enough of this talking. I want to get there and do things. Well, actually, I don't. Judging by what we've just did. All right, maybe I can skip it if I... There's supposed to be Pi's grave here, grave near here. I mean, it wouldn't hurt to look at it, right? All right, whatever. Maybe I should do something else, since there's an invisible wall. Jonathan Tremere, beloved man of the cloth, died while preaching. Oh, was, was he... um? Was he a clothing designer? Alright, so what am I picking up here? Some Levi's. I guess it doesn't hurt to show respect. Oh, we got we got Jonathan's beloved uh, hash pipe. Okay, here's a weird bottle. Take bottle. That bottle is like literally three-fourths of her body. And she just kind of put it... Where's the bottle? Where's she hiding the bottle? Oh my god. I know where she's hiding that bottle. That's why she wore a skirt. I'm being sexist again, aren't I? I need a holy weapon. Wasn't the fountain blessed? That's whole. All right, let's use the bottle or something. Let's use the bottle and the cell phone together. Nope, that doesn't work. So what do I do? I got the bottle. Wasn't that the fountain blessed? That's whole. What fountain? Where's the? All right, I guess I gotta go to some kind of fountain now. Historic graveyard. All right. Um, well, where's the fountain? Did we run by a fountain? Uh, lady, you get tired way too fast. I've seen fat men who don't get tired. This. Oh, there's a holy fountain. Yeah, this looks pretty holy. Some pennies in there. What a great holy fountain. Fill the bottle. And now we got a bottle filled with holy water. Let's drink from the fountain too, just to get extra holy. And now I can I can fling holy water by throwing. Oh, well I'm just throwing it over me. I'm not throwing it at enemies. All right, let's just keep going. This game is exciting. This is like Silent Hill, but instead of instead of like the guy from Silent Hill, our main heroine is a uh, secretary for a law firm. Yes, our heroine can type over 75 words per minute. All right, let's let's see here. The grave is sparkling. That's not a stock, but that skeleton swimming up out of the ground is a more pressing problem. All right, there's there's a skeleton. Let's kill it with the holy water we just per picked up. Yeah, I got you, bitch. That's what you get. That's what you get for being a skeleton. Burn, bitch. And now the customary dance, customary di victory dance. 
da 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 can't touch this da 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 oh what's this looks like a floating bone let's pick it up how do i it's a leftover bone hovering in the air because we are in space it clearly has magical properties yeah of course all right so i got a bone maybe i can use that bone where is she putting the bone oh, why am i even asking i know where she's putting all these things it says Thomas Dinry on the headstone. Pay respect. All right. This is my respect to you. I bow to you, Thomas. We being tormented, help us to rest. I need flowers for my grave. Bring me two or three nice pink ones. All right. Get pink flowers, right? I am in a haunted graveyard and you want flowers. Uh, so this is just like a... A fetching game where you get things and you put things and use things with other things and once in a while you throw holy water on your on yourself not at enemies on yourself okay where am I supposed to get flowers getting flowers for Rouse Tower okay and this is still a lot a lot less stressful than actually working for for a lawyer at a law firm and probably a lot less dangerous, too. Oh, this again. Come on. We already did this puzzle. Puzzles shouldn't repeat themselves. Uh, okay. I'm running out of holy water, but I guess I can just refill it at any time. What I need right now is some flowers. I feel like... All right, there's a... Let's pay our respect to this one as well. Let's just pay our respect to random dead people for no reason. Oh, there's some mushrooms. Probably poisonous. I mean, why wouldn't they be? All right, let's get the mushrooms. This is as close to flowers as I'm going to get in this cemetery. All right, there's a... That better not be a potato. All right, what is this? A melon! <laughs> a corpse melon! All right. All right, let's take a melon. Where is she putting the goddamn melon? Did she just eat it? Uh, let's pay respect. Praying. There's a little knob on the base of the statue with four different settings. Right now it's pointing at R. R. U. I don't know. I don't know what we're doing here. I don't know why we're doing it. But I got the gist of the game. You're a secretary, and someone set us up the husband, and uh, we have uh, we have no escape, so we better make our time and do the hammer dance and collect a bunch of flowers and then throw water all over ourselves. How come? What really bothers me, and when she throws water all, all over herself. She doesn't get all wet, like in a wet t-shirt contest. And I feel like that really holds the game back from being amazing. As it stands right now, it's just very good. It gets an official Stan Birdman rating of a 9.9999999. I sound like a I sound like a German person who really doesn't want something. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, my friends.